I didn't know a huge amount about Haven before I played it. I knew it was about a couple and it had gorgeous cell shaded art, but that was about it. So when I started playing it, I was pleasantly surprised at how much I enjoyed the characters, story and gameplay. The game follows Kay and Yu, a young couple stranded on a broken planet after escaping from their own world. As the game progresses, you learn about why they left their planet and see the consequences of their actions. I enjoyed the story and I was interested to see it unfold. I also liked the characters. I'm Kay and you came across as a believable sure couple, with banter and teasing each other, but also oh, genuinely caring for each other. For During the game, you can have them trigger cutscenes, like when you have them play a board game or eat together. These moments strengthen their bond, which is basically an XP system, to upgrade their stats and abilities. They also gain XP from battles, but I'll talk more about that later. Kay and you go out exploring this broken world, with islands connected by an energy source called Flow. They use this energy to charge their boots and glide around. It feels really satisfying gliding around each island, exploring for food, and part of the objective is to glide over glowing red patches in the ground to cleanse each island. The controls generally worked really well, although turning could sometimes be a little awkward when you do it too quickly. For the most part though, it just felt and looked great speeding around the islands, especially as a sunset or at nighttime when the graphics just look gorgeous. There are creatures around the islands, but some have also been corrupted by the red rust. You have to battle them, knock them down, and cleanse them. Are. Battles awesome. are kind of like the active time battles in Final Fantasy. Yep. When your action gauge fills up, you can execute Perfect. a move. You can defend, do a physical attack called impact, or a ranged attack called blast. You can combine these two attacks ready. to do duo attacks, go, go, go. with the pair attack together. Different enemies have different weaknesses, or they'll I'm only on. take real damage at a specific point in time. For example, if they've just executed ready. their own ready. attack, and they're stunned for a moment. You need to time your actions just right, balance defense and strike in just the right way. As you'd expect, early battles are pretty easy, but it does get challenging later on, especially when you have four different types of enemies to take on that require different strategies. There's kind of a rhythm to the battle, but when you're out of sync with enemy attacks, things can go very wrong. I had battles where I started with very high health and ended them with very low health because I wasn't getting the timing right or the right attacks. When it clicks though, it is very satisfying to juggle defense and attack and take on a group of tough beasts. As I mentioned, you get XP for beating enemies, and at the end of each day when you go to sleep, you level up your stats or unlock new moves, which are very useful. Health items are a bit scarce, I found, so I spent most of the game with my health under 50%. Going to sleep recovers some, but not much. It made battles much more precarious, but one good mechanic was that if K or U hit zero health in battle, the other can revive them with some of their health back. I managed to just about scrape through some tough battles using this approach of reviving and attacking, which isn't the way you'd really want to be managing battles, but it worked. The graphics, music and voice acting are great. After playing the game, I looked up the soundtrack, which is on YouTube, and even if you're not interested in the game, it's worth listening to the music. Those moments of gliding around the map are made even better thanks to the music. I think Haven is a great game, from the graphics to the story to the gameplay and music. It's not super long, but I found it really fun, and it's a perfect game while you're waiting for that next AAA release on the PS5 to check out. So guys, have you played Haven, and what did you think of it? Leave a comment below, and as always, thanks for watching.